Hello world, my name is Eric with Mycroft AI and I'm here to introduce you to our brand new Mycroft Translate Suite. We've been working really hard to bring this to the community and we're so excited to release it and have the community be able to start translating Mycroft between any two languages. First thing to note, we're using Poodle as our translation workflow software. Poodle is free open source software written in Python. If you want to learn more about Poodle, or any of the workings of the language translation suite. Our community manager, Kathy Reed, has a blog post up on the Mycroft blog where you can read all about it. That's at mycroft.ai slash blog. For now, I'm here to get you excited about the translation suite and learn a little bit about it. So first thing you wanna do is go to translate.mycroft.ai. You'll land on this page. If you click this sign in button, you'll be taken to the sign in. You'll need to sign up as a new user the first time you arrive, uh, but once you've done that, you'll get an email to confirm the account, and then you can come right back here and sign in. So we'll sign in, and this is your landing page. So first place you want to start is right up here on this bar. Browse and translate right here. This dropdown will take you in between all of the files that are to be translated. We'll stay in browse for right now. This is your languages dropdown. These are the starter languages that we're going to approach Mycroft for first. If you want to learn more about why we picked these languages, again, that's on Kathy's blog post. I do not actually speak two languages, but our resident Czech, David, has sent me over some translations for this video. So I'm going to click Czech. You would click whatever language you speak. And then projects. Projects are the first layer, the skills or terminology, and then second layer, the actual skills themselves. So we're going to translate a skill right now. These are all the skills that are in the Mycroft GitHub. They'll be automatically pulled in to the Poodle Translate Suite once they're approved and into the Mycroft GitHub repo for skills. I'm going to come down here to the Hello World skill and click on that. That'll be the one that I continue translating here. Uh, you can check out some of the statistics right here, but we're going to go straight to continue translation right here, which will pull up a flow of all of the untranslated either vocabulary, the things that Mycroft listens for, or dialogue, the things that Mycroft will say, and allow you to translate them from one language to another. You'll see the, in this case, English, the source language right here, and then a text box below that you will type in your translation into. So I'm just going to copy and paste it from the document that David sent me. So you'll type in your translation right there. And then over here, you'll click Submit. You could also hotkey to control enter. And once you hit Submit, it will take you straight down to the next utterance that needs to be translated. So for us, that's I'm doing very well. And I'll copy in the check. And then we'll try to control enter that time. Sometimes if there is a translation for a similar string in another section of the project, Poodle will bring up a terminology that you can click in. If that looks good, you can just click it and it will copy it over. Um, none of these match what David has sent me for this string. So I am going to ignore those and copy in what I have for that. And you'll just continue on like this until you finish a skill. It'll congratulate you and take you back to the overview page for that skill. I hope this gives you a good understanding of the Mycroft translation suite. And I hope you're excited to start translating Mycroft from English into any language, uh, be it Czech or Catalan, Chinese, Dutch, Filipino, French, German, Icelandic, any of them. If you want, need anything else, you can reach out to us at mycroft.ai, get active on the forums, join us in the chat, anything like that. We're happy to have you and thank you.